Hello and welcome, CGT fans. I'm your host, Joe Moore here, and we are in the Champion Galar Tournament right now. Um, If we win, we'll move on to the next round. If we lose, this will be the last video I make for the CGT, <laughs> uh, for now at least. But um, this guy brought everything I predicted, so that's great. Um, Let's see. Uh, I, I do... Let's see, what's a good lead? Um, I think Warts Art's the best lead. Because it deals with uh, Nido Queen, Tapu Koko. The only thing it doesn't deal with is... Uh, is Tangrowth. But I don't see that as a lead. And even if it does lead, uh, we could just go to Christ Thorn. Or Ferris Thorn. And get it out of there. But alright guys, Woo I'm nervous, I'm excited, I'm ready to go. Don't know if you can tell from the sound of my voice, but good luck, have fun, the wolf. He he uh he actually thought we were like a famous Charizard King because our name's Charizard King on Discord, and I guess he thought we were like a very famous Charizard King, and it was like uh no man, you know, just just a just a dude from Texas who likes to be who likes to call himself the Charizard King. Was given the nickname because of my love for Charizard, and here we go. So good luck, have fun again, Wolf, and uh, let's see if uh, let's see if we can send him packing because we do not want to end our tournament run. Uh, I made a great team in this place, and I really want to run it through. I, I want to kill it with it. You know what I mean? All right. So he has Tapu Koko. We are Rindo Berry, so we can live a grass knot. He gets his electric surge off, which not a big deal. Alucha is annoying, but uh, what's it called? Clefable walls that thing. I'm just gonna go ahead and go for the earthquake. He hits, he hits grass knot. He hits grass knot, but then he'll lose his cocoa, and then he'll have to run uh, Alucha right away, which I wouldn't be too worried about. He goes for the taunt, predicting we were going to go for Stealth Rocks. But no, man, we were going for the kill. We're going for the kill. We want this thing out of here. Oh, it lived. Nice and bulky. Um, Let's see. I'm just going to go Poison Jab, because if he does bring in Halucha here, I'll at least get some damage off. Oh, yeah, he wasn't staying in. Goomery. Oh, this is even better. Poison jab. Boom. How much does this do? Not over half, that's for sure. Can we get the poison? Nope. All right. So here we go. I'm actually okay with going Solaris. Uh, if we get knocked off, he's not. He's not. He's not going to click knock off. And it's time to put the chicken in the oven. I was going to make chicken in the oven when my timer went off. But this battle is more important. All right. What do you click here? Energy ball. Perfect. Uh, If he has rock slide, good on him. But I'm clicking quiver dance. No, I'm going to I'm gonna, I'm gonna click substitute because we don't want to get toxic or sleep powdered. No toxic or sleep powder for you, sir. If he switches, it'll suck because then uh, he can just go cloister at that point, but it's not too bad. Because if he sets up with cloister, we'll just go, um, we'll just go ferrothorn and red card it out. He does have rock slide. Okay, so I can't set up in front of this thing. I just got to hit it. I just have to hit it. So I'm just going to go ahead and click Fiery Dance. If it's Assault Vested, it's not going to kill. <laughs> just going to be honest. 
but I don't know if it is. So it might be a risky play, but you know, it's fine. Maybe that's why he stayed in, because he is assault vested. Oh yeah, he he might be assault vested. We do get the special attack boost. Can it miss? No, it cannot. Okay. It's all right. It's okay. Why was I worried about sleep powder? Oh, the electric terrain is up. Damn it. Okay. So I'm going to go warts art here, and I'm just going to go poison jab. I did have a thought of, um, sorry. I did have a thought of bringing in Haxorus and setting up. But way too early, I, I feel. Way too early for that. Because there's Mel Metal, and that thing's going to be hard to break. So I just click Poison Jab here. No, I, I click Knock Off. Because Knock Off will kill this thing. And if he switches anything in, that can abuse. Okay. I think this is fair. Choice Scarf. It's not set up. Well, it probably still has the capability of it. I'm going to go uh, Christ Thorn here. Oh, and it's Regenerator, so it's got health back. Oh, God, I hate it. He was Scarf Spikes. Interesting. I'm going to go ahead and go for the Toxic. Anything but Mel Metal. Or Needle Queen, actually. Oh, shit. I'm stupid. Okay. So he scarf spikes. I'm gonna go back to Wart's art. They're just gonna click flamethrower. And while he's thinking on that, I'm gonna go put chicken in the oven. Oh, he went Fire Blast. All right. Okay. All right. Um, I just go Earthquake. No reason not to. He's not going to go Halucha without the uh, terrain. Or does he? Nope. Goes back to Cloyster here. And that thing is bulky. All right, uh, going to go back to Ferrothorn. If he pulls a double, that's interesting. I mean, that would be great on his part, but very interesting. And spikes will just stack up. So, red card doesn't activate right away. Interesting. I thought it would activate after the first hit. But I guess it does not. So good thing we didn't let this thing set up. And what do we get in here? Oh, we get Mel Metal. Fantastic. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and just Leech Seed. He's thinking about what he wants to do here. Taking a real long while to think. 
but we are leech seeding. We already clicked it. We're locked in. He goes double iron bash. This doesn't kill, I don't think. And it's going to get some very good. Oh, no. Protective pads. Nice. So we're going to get a uh, leech seed off. And we'll get a lot of health back, hopefully. Enough to live another one, I believe. Oh, big time. All right. And now we just go knock off. All right. He withdraws. He goes to Goomery. And we'll get another knockoff here. And we'll see that assault vest. Yeah. Ah, beautiful. Okay. And now I am going to go for... Now I am going to go for Gyro Ball. I believe he switches into Nido King now. Yep. I mean Nido Queen, sorry. Agatha. I should have just switched. Ooh, that is a good chunk. Okay. And now... I'm going to go to Kurt. I wonder if they double out to Cloyster right away. And if they do, that'd be great. Honestly, it would be. Honestly, it would be. And then we can just close combat something. Or something. Or something. Let's see. Oh, they're taking a minute. <laughs> All right. They're really thinking what they want to do here. I, I, I believe they're just going to click uh, Cloister. I mean, this is land, so there's no timer. Uh, they stayed in. And we are assault vested on Kurt, so hopefully it doesn't hurt too bad. Oh, beautiful play. Beautiful play. Even assault vested. That hurt. Oh, crit. Oh, my goodness. Is it? I'm just, am I just going to get crit every game? Um, I'm just going to go Earthquake. Probably should have went triple axle, but I'm just going earthquake. Oh, not a good time. Click sludge wave again, but we should live. Oh, we don't. <laughs> we do not. Is that thing specs? Because that hit hard. That hit very hard. I am going. I, I need to. I need to get some kill here. So I'm gonna just go ahead and test the waters, because they took way too long to make that play. So I am going to just click gyro ball. Nope, they weren't. Oh, so much for that. <laughs> they just hit like a truck. They're not life orb either. Okay, here we go. We're going to go to Warts Art here. We got to save Clefable. I mean, not that Clefable could do anything to this thing anyway. But we got to save Clefable for that Halucha. And um, right now it's not looking good. Not looking good at all. So we're going to go ahead and just click Earthquake. Well, that crit really sucked because uh, we could have lived that second one if not for the crit. And we could have gotten rid of this thing.
But that is Pokemon, I guess. And then we threw away our Ferrothorn, so that was just stupid on my part. But I really thought this thing was choiced into something. That's why they, they took so long to make a decision on what to do. But they didn't. They weren't, I mean. Goomery, this thing's almost at full again. Jesus Christ. All right, uh, we go ahead and get the Earthquake off. It's not going to do that much. Um, I should have got rocks off earlier. I'm just going to go Poison Jab. It's not going to kill, but it will do good damage. And then Haxorus is just going to have to come in and win the game. So we're not out of it yet. I mean, we don't lit, we don't outspeed unburden Halucha. So I mean, that's still a problem. Can we get a crit? No. Okay. Not even a toxic. Okay, this is special, but it still kills. All right. <laughs> Fun. Super fun. All right, we're going to go Grim Reaper here, and we're just going to click Dragon Dance. Kind of want to click twice, but I don't think even then I'd be faster than Halucha anyway. So let's just click, uh, let's just click Dragon Dance once. Let's see what Tangrowth decides to do here. But it's not looking good for us. But at least we know it's not Sleep Powder set. Because that would suck. Gonna knock off our Life Orb, but that's fine. I mean, we're plus one still. Helps our longevity, that's for sure. And I'm just gonna click Poison Jab. And then uh, he's probably going to sack Tapu Koko after that. But then we go into um, Clefable to take care of the Halucha. It's just Melmetal still has a bunch of health still. That's the problem. I don't think Haxorus 1v1's uh, Melmetal. So the obvious play would go Tapu Koko here. Let's see what he decides to do. Pandora. And that's Cloyster. Alright, so we're just going to Dragon Claw it. No reason to predict. Just hit what's in front of us. Ice Shard. Okay. That doesn't kill, hopefully. It doesn't. And we will get the knockout here. Does he have priority on anything else? Because if he does, that's GG. Why would he have Scarf Ice Shard? That is weird. Okay. I mean, you know, it is what it is. Uh, uh, losing the Life Orb actually helped us. Believe it or not, I'm going to click Poison Jab just in case he decides to switch straight into Halucha, which would be not wise, but, you know. Crazier things have happened. He did run a Choice Scarf Ice Shard Cloister. Or they, not sure. Sorry. Poison Jab goes ahead and takes this thing out. Cacao. All right. Get your own burden boost there, buddy. Nice gimmick. But we're going to go to Yoda. You're probably going to Swords Dance. No, he'd hit because he doesn't want to die. So he's going to hit us. He probably clicks Iron Head if he has it. Acrobatics. 
that is so much. But we should live another one. So, big brain play here. Um, does he swap or stay in? Uh, I can't afford to not hit, so I'm just going to take Moonblast. Yeah, he swaps. Obvious play. Into Agatha. But now Halucha doesn't have the speed boost anymore. I mean, it's still fast. But if we can... But if we can... Get another Dragon Dance up somehow. That'd be fantastic. I'm going to go Mystical Fire to get the for sure special attack drop if we do outspeed. Or if we even live this. We might. Nope, we don't. Okay. Oh, well, it's a GG, because, I mean, uh, I can't, I can't outspeed that, I can't outspeed uh, Halucha, so this game is over. I should have saved, um, I should have saved Ferrothorn, I should have just went straight into Wart's Art. That's, that could have still saved me the game, but uh, GG, nonetheless, we're going to take out Agatha unless he switches. Nope, doesn't want to risk it. Fair enough. Agatha goes down, and unless he is like no speed investment Halucha, we lose. Because we are max speed. I mean, gotta be. Actually, no, we're not. We're we're uh, Jolly 128, just enough to outspeed a Coco after a, dra a Dragon Dance. So I'm just going to Dragon Claw. And uh, GG's to Wolf. But alright guys. I mean that was a fun battle. Got to use a team. Uh, put together late. And um, it was a fun battle. I enjoyed it. I will see you guys in the next video.